What is up ladies and gentlemen, today I'll be showing you how to get a bunch of charms in Monster Hunter Stories 2. So guys, for those of you that aren't aware, the prayer pot here will accept charms which boost your chances of getting multiple different benefits. So at the moment we've got a finding charm active which gives us an extra 12.5% easier, so more 12.5% chance to find monsters with rare genes for 30 minutes. Now we've activated a bunch of these, so it's an extra 12% for rare eggs. Now as you level up, this prayer pot, these charms will actually give you more of a percentage, as well as that you'll also get more prayers. So you currently see here, we have our prayer pot at level 5. Uh, we have access to might prayer, lucky prayer, finding prayer, gathering prayer, and training prayer. Now, we could technically probably get this up to, I'd say, level 15 at the minimum, based off the charms we have. But today, guys, I'm going to show you how you get a bunch of charms super easy. And that is through monster expeditions. So guys, we've got two expeditions that have just returned from Hakalo Island and out of the three areas that we have access to to do these expeditions, I would say Hakalo Island is the best as these will give you the charms that allow you to find eggs with rarer genes. So you can currently see here we received four finding charms, just like that. So each of these lasts for half an hour and it takes half an hour I believe to do an expedition, sorry, 20 minutes. To do an expedition to get these charms so you are literally outputting more charms than you would use so it's great look at this we got five here and they were super easy to get now in order to get these uh the ones that boost the gene slots you want to select the field hakalo island you can select the other two if you do select the other two you'll receive different charms uh, i believe you receive the adamant charm from akala and then the point boosting charm from Loloska. Um, I'll show you those guys in the prayer pots in just a second. But what you want to do is you want to select the Treasure Hunter Instructions. And this will guarantee you that you will get charms at the end of the expedition. So we're going to send these guys straight back out because we are going to farm the crap out of these charms so that we get tons of them. But if we come back over to the prayer pot here, I will show you the other two that we get. So yeah, you get the Lucky Charm and the Adamant Charm. They are the other charms that you get from the other two locations on the expeditions. So 77 points to battles and then decreases damage. So I would farm those areas up for the charms so that you could level up your prayer pot. But definitely farm up Hakalo Island for the finding charms because it is totally worth it. But guys, just a nice quick video for you guys today. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. If you did, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe down below for more.